Hello, I'm Martha Garrett. I've been in Christian school for many years. I was uh, able to start in the early 1970s when my pastor started Huntington Christian Academy and I was able to begin teaching then and I have continued all this time and I'm very, very thankful that the Lord opened the way for me to do that. Uh, he led and guided me to make the choice to, to do this over other things that I was considering at the time and I'm very thankful for his leading and I have really, really enjoyed my time here. I love the students. I've enjoyed interacting with them and they've kept me young and I feel that uh, I have done something that will um, uh, be counted for eternity. I am glad that uh, the Lord can use what he allows us to do and I'm, I'm very thankful for the, all that. I want to be grateful and to give him the praise and glory. And I think of Psalm 103 that talks about all he has done for us, how he has forgiven us our iniquities and he has healed our diseases and he has redeemed our lives from destruction. And that's what I hope I can instill in these students, all that God has done for them, how he loves them and how he can uh, uh, use their lives in a, a mighty way that will count for eternity. So I'm very grateful and thankful to be here and I will certainly miss all the students and teachers and everybody, but um, I look back and I'm thankful that that's what the Lord let me do. Hi, I'm Connie Horton and I've been here for a little less than 20 years, so I haven't come to the Christian school movement quite as early as some other people. I spent some time teaching public school but and then raising children, but I know that with grace, uh, those words, I being in the way the Lord led me, because the teacher who was here before me was leaving to take another job, and it was one of those things that the Lord would just not leave alone. I had no intention of coming back to teaching, and then I found myself awake at night thinking, how would I teach this? And so the Lord worked out all the details that I ended up here uh, to teach school. I love teaching. I especially love history. And I love the fact that God demonstrates to us how He works through the lives of people. Um, every time I tell you a story in history, it's for you to understand that God was in the, at work in the lives of individuals, and He is at work in your individual lives also. Uh, I am also thankful for the opportunity to share faith and share my faith with my students and to encourage them that God not only hears us, but he answers us. And a very precious verse to me is Romans 8, 26. It says that whenever I don't know how to pray, the Holy Spirit prays in my place. And I am so thankful for that. I'm thankful for my students, for the things that they have taught me, for how they've helped me to grow and have encouraged me. And I hope that that's, part of, uh, that's a part that I have played in their lives to help them to be stretched spiritually and to be stretched academically. I look forward to them coming back and them telling me how they're doing, and I am so thankful for the Lord at work in their lives and that demonstration. And for those of you who are going to ask, no, I don't know what I'm going to do when I grow up yet, and maybe the whole idea is I won't grow up, but uh, when it's time, the Lord will let me know what the next phase of my life is and what I'm going to do. I can't imagine sitting around and doing nothing. so just waiting for the Lord to tell me what's next, but I have loved every moment of being with you, and I appreciate it so much. Thank you. It's hard for me to believe that I've been at Grace for 25 years. Uh, my youngest daughter was in the ninth grade when I came to teach here uh, and to be the assistant administrator. Uh, I've really enjoyed my 25 years here. I don't know that there's any one particular thing I would say I've enjoyed most about teaching. Uh, other than the students, uh, I've always enjoyed uh, being with students and trying to help them to learn. Uh, I especially enjoyed my time of coaching while I was here uh, and uh, enjoyed that. Uh, coached several of the different teams and I uh, enjoyed being able to do that and just thankful the Lord gave me the opportunity for that. I'm thankful for all the opportunities I've had and for all the students that uh, I've been able to hopefully make some kind of an influence in their lives. Uh, I would just kind of leave you with one verse, Philippians 3.10, that I may know him, the power of his resurrection, and the fellowship of his sufferings 
being made conformable unto his death. If I could stress one thing to students is get to know the Lord. Thank you for allowing me to be here for 25 years.